Hey what's up guys this is Techwini here and today we'll be taking a really quick look at this mini drone from Afunta. From all the past reviews that I've done so far for companies none of them were as fun and exciting as this one. This was totally a new experience for me, I've never flew a drone before in my life and it was challenging to learn all the controls and tricks from the manual. But a few hundred or thousand hits on the walls and the ceilings, I think I kind of know how to operate it now. I see all these big drones with 4K cameras online and whenever I saw them I thought it was super easy to fly a drone. Just read the manual, watch a couple of videos and you're a professional. No, I was wrong. It is not easy to fly a drone and if you're thinking to buy a really expensive drone you're making a mistake. I would recommend buying one of these and doing a really good practice in becoming a pro in this other than buying an expensive drone and crashing it in the first try. There's not a lot that comes with the drone and that is why the price is so great. You only get the things that you need. You get the drone with 4 blades already installed and 4 more spare blades. You get a charger but no adapter. I'm sure you can find a dozen of adapters at home. You get a controller. Make sure you put 2 AAA batteries in there. The drone has 4 LED lights. 2 red and 2 blue. They're super bright. You want the red lights to be facing you when you try to fly it. Let me show you guys how to sync the controller with the drone. While the controller is off, put the left throttle all the way down and then turn the controller on. Put the left throttle up and then down. You will see that the drone lights are not blinking anymore. They are constant red at the front and blue in the back. The left throttle is used to go up and down. The right throttle is used to steer the drone. Up motion makes it go forward, down motion makes it go back. Left motion makes it go left, lastly right motion goes to right. If you're wondering if a micro USB cable is used to charge the drone, it is not. It is this weird charger input. Make sure you don't lose it because you're not going to be able to find it or buy it. You'll have to buy a new drone for that. When you plug it into the USB wall, it lights up red. That means it is not charging anything. And you will still get the light when you plug it into the drone when the drone is on. Make sure you turn the drone off and then plug it into the charge. You will see now that the charger does not light up. It will eventually light up after 10 to 15 minutes after the drone is fully charged. I will now share all the pages of the manual. I know that some of you want to know the full directions. That is all in this quick review video, the links to purchase it is down below and once again I recommend practicing with this drone before purchasing a very expensive drone out there. Thanks for watching guys, please support my channel by hitting the subscribe button. Please like the video if you enjoyed, I put a lot of effort in these videos so it is always a good feeling to see that people like my videos. If you dislike the videos tell me why because I'd like to know, I'd like to improve on my videos. There's more videos coming up, I'll see you guys in the next one.